don't know who you are, but your time is impeccable. I'm just passing through. Fair enough. But the enemy of my enemy is my friend, right? And those raiders want us all dead, including you. I have my own problems, Garvey. Yeah? Like what? You help us, maybe we can help you. My son Sean's been kidnapped. He's not even a year old. That's my stuff.
there that trader came through selling traps? Sure, but he was charging so much I could sell him Lucy and that still wouldn't cover it. Blake Abernathy, shame on you. That's our daughter you're talking about. Just telling you how it is, dear. <sighs> you guys gonna be okay now? Yeah, for a while anyway. We can at least move someplace. Listen, when we first met, you said you were just passing through. Well, maybe this will help you reconsider. Ain't much, but it's the best we can do. And you've earned it. I'll take what I can get. <laughs> Spoken like a true merc. Well, if you ever feel like fighting for something other than yourself, you should meet up with us in Sanctuary. I could use someone like you. Someone who can get things done. What would I need to do? You'd need to stay strong like you've been. Because there's more to your destiny. I've seen it. And I know your pain. My destiny? What do you mean? You're a man out of time. Out of hope. But all's not lost. I can feel... Your son's energy, he's alive. Where is my son? Where is Sean? Oh, I wish I knew, kid. I really do. But it's not like I can see your son. I can just feel his life force, his energy. He's out there. And even I don't need the sight to tell you where you should start looking. A great green jewel of the Commonwealth. Diamond City. The biggest settlement around. What's in Diamond City? Is Sean there? Look, kid. I'm tired now. Maybe you'll bring me some chems later. The sight will paint a clearer picture. No. Mama Murphy, we talked about this. That junk. It's gonna kill you. Ah, shush, Preston. We're all gonna die eventually. We're gonna need the sight. And our new friend here, he's gonna need it too. Now let's get going. Sanctuary awaits. All right, folks. Thanks to our friend here, it's safe to move out. We're heading for that place Mama Murphy knows about. Sanctuary. It's not far. She knows about it? You mean she had one of her visions while she was stoned out of her gourd? And now you want us to just head out on another wild goose chase based on no better plan than Mama Murphy saw it? It can hardly oh, hold turn on, hold worse on. than... Everybody just take it easy. We're all in this together, right? So Marcy, you got a better idea of what we should do next? Anybody? Well then, sanctuary it is. Let's just hope it lives up to its name. Come on, June, it's time to go. Oh, okay. Get the price we paid to get this far. Let's move out. I'll take point. Stick close, everyone. We're right behind you, boss. Your idea of heaven, eh, Sturgis? Could be some good salvage in there. Let's get to Sanctuary first, though. I think we're close. Monument to the original Minutemen. I knew that was somewhere around Concord. That means 
this right here. You're talking about, boss, but I'm glad you're happy about it. Fire. That's it. I'm glad you decided to come with us. I should have listened to Mama Murphy all along. Pretty nice place she's found for us. I think we could settle down here. Make it a place to call home. What do you think? Take your time. Yeah. I used to like living here. Before the war. What do you mean? Before what war? Are you saying... I lived here over 200 years ago. I was frozen or something for most of it. Just woke up a little while ago. Damn. Like one of those old pre-war ghouls. You say you were frozen. Anybody else make it out with you? 